with Carly McCutcheon, who's getting her horse ready to get shown this weekend. Carly, what are you going to be showing in? The youth. The youth? Yes. All right, cool. Now, uh, where? Uh, what's your favorite arena here at the Tulsa Reign Classic? <laughs> the Super Duty. You said duty. Oh, what? Um, now, what? Uh, what's your game plan when you're going to go show? Like, are you going to go super fast, medium fast, going to so super slow? Are you going to make sure your hat stays on? Like, what, what are you thinking? What, did it, are you staying up at night trying to get nervous, or what's the deal? I'm just going to win. You're just going to win. Just that simple, huh? Just just win, and if that doesn't happen, what if you don't win? Then I just had fun trying. Well, that's a pretty darn good attitude. You just have fun trying. There you have it, folks. Carly McCutcheon seems like she's got everything figured out. If she doesn't win, she's just going to have fun trying. Carly, good luck, and we'll see you in the winter circle, okay? <laughs> okay, thank you. I Isabel Martin, who just showed in the youth class, had a pretty good run, had a few bobbles, Isabel, but for the most part, your horse looked pretty good. What'd you think? I thought it was great. It was not my best run, but I, and I can do better, so I've got things to work on. That's great. You know, you work, you ride with NRHA professional Heath Jones. Um, I heard he's pretty crazy at times, gets to yelling and jumping around when you don't do do everything perfect. Um, so when he gets all wild like that, do you just put your head down, say whatever, and ride on, or, or do you stand there and uh, take the abuse? <laughs> no, he's really nice. <laughs> well, Isabel, thanks for talking to us. You had a good run. Like I said, you had some stuff to work on, but for the most part, it looked pretty good to us. Okay, thank you. We're here with Jacob Zimmerman and just marked a 143 for the youth 13 and under. Jacob, had a smoking run, man. I mean, you were in there just, I mean, sliding a mile, dude. You were running fast. They said you just knocked it out of the park. What'd you think your run, man? Looked like your horse pretty good. Well, I, had, I was happy with it. He tried to um, change, but I held him through it all, and it was good. I liked it, and his rollbacks were really nice. Now, your sister uh, rides horses. Your dad showed quite a bit. Um, you ride with NRHA professional Bobby Avila. What, uh, any good advice he gave you going in, or did he just yell at you and say, just better not mess up this time, Jacob? Well, he said, well, he said that he had to go afterwards. But my, one of my friends, she said she gave me advice because we're riding for the team, and she wanted me to get, do good, so I tried as hard as I could. Yep. Good run, and uh, we'll be looking for you next time, man. Looks like you're on the right track. Yeah, hopefully. <laughs> Good deal, bud. Thanks for the interview. You're welcome. We're here with Blair Thompson, just marked a 144 in the used 14 to 18 class here at the Tulsa Rain Classic. Blair, dude, I saw you getting ready out there, man. I thought you were like in the non-pro or in the open derby or something, man. Your horse looked awesome. How do you feel in the pin? Uh, he, he just felt so great. Probably the best he's ever felt. Now you ride with NRHA professional Melanie Wilhelm. Uh, she really gets you guys prepared. What uh, what kind of advice she give you before you're going in? You know, she just said be smooth in everything you do and try not to push anything too hard. So I thought that really helped me. Now, uh, is this first class you've been showing in this week? Uh, no, sir. I schooled all week, and then actually just a couple minutes ago, I was I showed in the non-pro. How'd you do, How'd you do over there? Uh, same score. Same score. It's pretty consistent, man. I mean, uh, are you going to start uh, trying to maybe enter in the open anytime soon and see if you can knock some of these guys out? Uh, I'll wait a couple of years. I'll wait a couple of years before I can try that. I don't think I'm good enough yet. But. Like I said, I watched you getting ready. I didn't know who you were. Your horse looked awesome. And uh, like I said, dude, looked awesome. Thank you. We're here over at the Mustang Arena at the Tulsa Rainy Classic where Andy Wells just marked a 142 and a half. Huge score. Danny, you're showing over here too. Danny Latimer marked 143. Both you guys ride with Dean Latimer. He's your dad. How fun is that having your dad yell at you all the time? It's fun sometimes. Now, you were running around there pretty fast, okay? Now, when uh, Dean's helping you out in the warm-up pen and getting you ready, is he nicer to you than he is to Danny or about the same? The same. Definitely the same. He doesn't yell at, at Danny more or say, hey, Danny, you need to ride like, like you know, these other guys. He, he's yeah, nicer to I you. think he's nicer than me, to me. Now, what's, uh, what's some good advice Dean gave you before you went in? Go have fun. 
go have fun. That's pretty good advice. Looked like it worked. Both you guys had a super run. Hopefully your scores will hold up. You win some, some pretty good prizes.